Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. iPhones are known for its performance and fluidity, but believe me, sometime my iPhone 12 freezes. And it can be because of multiple reasons. It can be by installing a third party application, which I use sometime, or it can be any other application playing in the background, making the phone unusable. Sometimes a new software update also brings some performance issues and makes the iPhone unusable at a certain time. It can be quite frustrating, especially if you need to use your iPhone in a crucial time or make a phone call and suddenly it hangs on you. But there is a very easy fix to this. So in this video, let's try to find out if your iPhone is freezing or hanging on you, how to fix it in a very easy and simple manner. But before I start, kindly subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon so you'll get notified every time I post a new video. Welcome back. So suppose you are facing this issue that your iPhone screen is stuck and frozen and you are not able to do anything. No button is working. In this scenario, there is a very simple and easy fix. All you need to do is press the volume up button, then press the volume down button. And last thing you have to do is keep pressing the power button or the side button until you see a blank screen. So let's do it one by one. Volume up, then volume down. And now keep pressing the power button. You will see this slide to power off indication. Just ignore it and keep pressing the power button until you see a blank screen. Now you can leave the power button as the screen is blank. The iPhone will soft reset itself. So all the issues you are facing will vanish after the fresh reboot. This is one of the best and the easiest solution. See now everything works fine after the fresh reboot, touch will be responsive, any freezing issues you were facing will all be gone after this fresh reboot. It does not happen very often on iPhones but yes sometime it does happen because of some third party application or it can be any other reason. But regardless of the reasons, suppose it happens to you and you are in a situation where you really need to use the phone or make a phone call or use Apple Pay in case of any emergency, this is a very easy solution to fix any issues you are facing. This method will work with any iPhone or iPad. But Touch ID iPhones will have slightly different method. So guys, this was a small trick. I hope it will help you in your iPhone usage and experience. If you like this video, kindly hit the thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't. See you soon in my next one. Till then, goodbye, peace and blessings. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you like the video, kindly hit the thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. I will really appreciate that. Also click on the notification icon, the bell icon, so you'll constantly get updated with my new videos. Thank you for watching and see you in my next video. Till then, goodbye.